Hey guys, Coach Mack here with this week's Beneath the Surface, powered by Microsoft Surface, beginning now. We are going to look at some of the offensive and defensive schemes we are going to see from the New York Giants in this opening game here at Nissan Stadium. So we're going to look at the offense, Brian Dable, head coach. So we are going to look at the Giants this year, what they did in some preseason, and then we're also going to look at what he did in Buffalo to see some of the schemes that the Titans defense is going to have to be ready for. And what we're looking at here, we're looking at a three by two set. They've taken Saquon Barkley to not only empty him out of the backfield on a man zone indicator, they want to use him in passing situations. In this play, you can see that he's split out. The defense now has walked out to get into a zone coverage. Daniel Jones chooses to go downfield on a takeoff route. But the thing I want to emphasize here is Saquon Barkley, from what Brian Dable is going to do, we're going to see a lot of different formations. The Titans defense must be ready to adjust to personnel groups. And then also Saquon Barkley in a lot of different spots. Next thing we're looking at here, this is Buffalo. Watch what the Titans do on defense. They've got various guys moving around in an amoeba type look which means they're lining up in different spots. As you see the Titans moving around, they are going to look like they're bringing four or five people, and then all of a sudden they're gonna back out, bring three people, drop into a cover eight with a spider dropper in the middle, confuses the quarterback, throws behind the receiver, results in a turnover. Titans defense is going to have to do a good job of disguising coverage pre-snap and then post-snap, working into some sort of defense that the quarterback is not going to be able to expect this year. Daniel Jones is going to have to decipher all of this at the line of scrimmage in Nissan Stadium. Now let's look at the defense. The defense we're looking at is Baltimore's defense. Don Wink Martindale, longtime defensive coordinator in this league, is very well known for his multiple blitzes. You can see this is an overload look with an overload to the Titans' right side. You've got some wide alignments up front. Here you can see what the Titans have done. They've done a very nice job. Look at the nice cylinder protection that they have given. And then Ryan Tannehill has got to get the ball out of his hands very quickly. This is a nice use of the tight end here. The tight ends this year will probably be a big part of any attacks that the Titans are going to do on offense this year, especially against this defense that we're going to see at Nissan Stadium. All right, this next play, again, you can see the defense moving around. This is, a, this is a closed formation here by the offense. What they're going to try to do, they're going to initially evolve into a stack release look over here on their right side to be able to counteract the man-to-man -man defenses. Now they're trying to decide what the coverage is. Nice little stack release, clear shot, clear vision of the quarterback. These are just some of the instances that you will see this week against Brian Dable's offense and Wink Martindale's defense. 